Now that they're going solo, just like the rest of the BLACKPINK members, Lisa has only signed contracts for group activities with YG, which means that solo activities starting now will be managed directly by the members individually and not YG, their entertainment label agency. That means the earnings or revenues for solo activities will be received directly by the members. YG will no longer profit from their individual activities. That's the main idea. Now let's go over to Lisa. Will Lisa establish her own label or agency? The rest of the three members were reported to start establishing their own label. As with Lisa, it was initially reported that she will sign up with an international label. Lisa's solo music sales are massive. Why just produce that right genre for Lisa? With Lisa's new label, how will this affect her music? Will they be able to surpass YG's hype and marketing for Lisa? Will there be a revamp for Lisa's music going forward now that she is not YG exclusive anymore? We fans are looking forward to her upcoming solo music. Surprise us, Lisa! With Lisa's new agency, how would the new dynamics be? It's quite intriguing already having to wait to which label or agency Lisa will be signing up if she's not going to be having her own agency. Will there be more brand deals now that Lisa is going solo? No one's stopping her, plus all of the earnings go to her directly. Her YouTube has done so much more. It's just growing massively going forward. I bet Lisa will also be launching her own solo merchandises, now that she's a solo artist managing her own. With Lisa's creative mind, I'm betting there will be cool merchandises that we will be introduced to. Will Lisa produce her very own light stick? Additionally, she will be having solo concerts and performances all over the world, so her very own light stick isn't far-fetched. The idea could be plausible. Her brand is insanely massive. Can we also add to the fact that her rumored boyfriend belongs to the top 1% families of the world? Lisa's future is shining so bright and she deserves this for all the hard work she did and the humility she imbibed all throughout her career. There were talks and articles about Lisa participating in the Walking Dead spin-off. There were no official statements yet, just speculations. Speculation started circulating when Lisa's visits to Paris coincides with the filming of the Walking Dead spin-off. Of course, we're hoping she'd be a part of it. Lisa has worked diligently with humility over the past years and she is amassing returns from all the hard work. From a teenager who trained, to someone who debuted as an idol, and now to someone who has a massive worldwide brand name and image. Well, that's La Lisa Manaban for you guys. We can't wait for what's next in store and what she can offer to the world.